Simon Says, subscribe and click on the bell icon to receive notifications. Hello everyone, welcome to a new tutorial from Simon Says It. In this video, I will show you how to calculate standard deviation in Excel. We are familiar with Excel's potential to solve complex mathematical and statistical problems. One such common statistical concept that's widely used in real time is the standard deviation. When there's a lot of data, Excel has a set of built-in functions to help you arrive at the standard deviation easily. There are eight functions in Excel which help you calculate the standard deviation of the given data set. Each function has its own characteristics and is used depending on the user's requirements. The functions can be broadly classified into two, the formulas which are used to calculate the standard deviation for the data sample and the formulas which are used to calculate the standard deviation for the whole population. To calculate the standard deviation, first choose a destination cell. Enter the formula equals STD. Once you enter the initials of the formula, Excel shows you a dropdown from where you can choose the formula you want. It also contains the description and features of the particular function. Depending on your choice, you can either enter the formula by double clicking on the desired formula or by using the keyboard arrow keys to navigate and press the tab key. Then you can enter the arguments. Remember, only the first argument is mandatory and the rest of the arguments are optional. In this case, let us pass the first argument as the cell range. Press Enter. This gives the standard deviation of the data in the given range of cells. In this video, we saw how to calculate standard deviation in Excel. Depending on your purpose, you can choose the formula and calculate the standard deviation. Thank you. If you're not a subscriber, click down below to subscribe so you get notified about similar videos we upload. To see the full blog article that this video came from, please click over there. And click over there to see more videos from Simon Says It.